walk you through how to do a virtual field trip because I'm going to be including those a lot with my lessons. So starting from my homepage here, Art with Mrs. F, you click on virtual field trips and then you'll see that there's a whole bunch of icons here that you can click on to go to certain places. Uh, for example, I've already done one lesson with the Van Gogh Museum um, and I have lots of different cool places in here. Now, some of these are um, videos or, for example, the art museum is a digital gallery, which means you click through the pictures. But some of them, especially ones that have this little explore, um, are actual virtual tours where you can walk through the museum. And it's pretty cool. Um, so most of these are done through Google Arts and Culture. So I'm just going to show you how to navigate through there. So when you click on it, it takes you to the main Google Arts and Culture page dinosaurs pretty cool so i want to show you um, how to find these virtual tours you click on these bars here and you go to explore and then you have a few options here there's art camera which you can actually see real paintings and artwork up close it's really cool you can see the texture of the paint 360 views is cool you should check that out um there's lots of different um, places that you can actually look all the way around there's even some in outer space um, but what I mostly use is Street View, and in here there's lots of different um, famous uh, historical sites and places around the world. Um, I'm going to show you with a place I've actually been before. This is the Palace of Versailles in France. Um, it's a place uh, just a little bit outside of Paris, and um, it's uh, this beautiful palace. Now, um, when you go in here, you'll see at the bottom there's all these different um, pictures that you can click on to go to different rooms and see different things. But to move forward when you're in the palace, you simply need to take your mouse. Or if you have a touch screen, you can use your finger to move. Or something really cool is you can pick up your um, laptop or iPad, whatever you're watching on, and actually move it side to side. You can look around inside. And something really cool, you can also look up. This shows you all the way around. It's pretty amazing. Now, to move forward, all you do is you tap your screen or use your mouse to click forward. You see a little arrow there, and it will actually move you forward through here. But as you're moving, you can also click to the side, um, and you can see the artwork, um, these sculptures, and like I said, um, you can even see the ceiling. It's pretty cool. So I'm going to show you another one. Um, this is also, um, this is actually my favorite city in the world, Venice. I've been here a few times. And um, the cool part about this is we're riding on a boat and we can actually travel down the canals and you can go under this bridge here. You can see um, everything around you. And um, you can even go in the, the city on the sidewalks as well, but I like to stay on the canal. So you can travel through here um, you'll notice people's faces are blurred out, but you can see everything else and it's pretty amazing. So um, take a look around, um, find you know some museums or historical sites, anything that interests you. And I will also be including these in my lesson. So I hope this helps um, you guys to understand how to do these. Please just send me an email if you have any questions. All right, enjoy.